Hey, Mads. And a route back, your new therapist. The truth always stems from childhood. Oh, listen, Dr. Rudbeck, I don't care about his treatment or his well-being. He's a criminal. This is my job. Before I knew it, I was already on his back, strangling him. The gurgling sound that came out of his throat was his animal. I saw him. And the other boy, too. Matt, what are you saying? He just confessed another murder. Have you ever thought that he just might happen to be the first Swedish serial killer? You don't understand. Precisely. That's why I'm here. Try to feel for him. He needs to be heard and understood. He killed a 13-year-old boy. Did this really happen? I mean, I'm, I'm not even certain what I remember. Maybe it's all just my imagination. But he's a victim, too. Get out of the matter! How old were you when it first happened? Three. And what did your father do to you? I was so ashamed. It's not a matter of choice, it's about your survival. You must have had something I was desperate for. I don't know what it was. I don't think I ever had such a relationship with anyone before. <laughs>